Now to that developing story in District Heights. A teenage girl is dead this morning, and a man is left critically injured after they were both shot inside a home. News 4's Dominic Moody is live at the scene this morning on Tenal Place, or Tenal Place, with the latest on what we know. Dominique. Yes, good morning, Tony. And we still see some of those investigators right behind us. Let's take you closer into the scene. You can see one of them right outside of where it is believed that that daughter or excuse me that that young woman and that uh, man actually was shot here this morning uh, overnight and we now know that this is still a very much active investigation we got crime scene tape here and then we got crime scene tape just beyond uh, in front of the door and then on the other side so again very much still an active scene here as investigators really try to piece together what exactly happened following the shooting of a man and a teenager girl who was pronounced dead at a nearby hospital earlier this morning. Now, according to police, this happened around 9 o'clock last night. When police got here, they found both that the young teenager and a man were suffering from critical gunshot injuries. Now, investigators say they aren't looking for any suspects and believe everyone involved is accounted for inside the home. The man who was shot is believed to still be in critical condition. Now, again, back out here live, we know the crime scene unit is here this morning. They have been here trying to really piece together all of the information that they have. In addition to that, they also have been collecting some of the evidence uh, and walking outside of the unit here. So it still seems like they're really trying to gather any clues that could help them with this investigation. Back to you.